Yo, hello. Guys? Welcome back. Today's video, we are doing some very, uh, very different. Very Different. We're bringing the US to the UK. Well, if you've ever been to America, you might have heard of In N Out Burger. Even if you haven't been there, you've probably heard of it. It's a famous chain that sells good burgers, quick, easy, yeah. and they have this spread that is fire. Beautiful. And uh, we're basically gonna make the burger, the spread, we got buns, we got everything, and we're gonna recreate that burger and bring it to the UK. As best we can. As far as ingredients go, we have them all on the screen right now, so you can screenshot. Pause it, screenshot. Take a look, add it to your list, add it Four to your bun. beautiful brioche buns, we got a nice minced meat for the burgers, yep. tomatoes, onions, butter, blah, 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 it's all in the description, guys. Just, Just go down there. You're gonna hate this, but this is quite a, um, a long process. Great, great. So we're gonna start with the butter. The okay. butter goes in the saucepan, guys. Yes. Melt that down. So first we're gonna add the butter, melt it, and then we're gonna add two onions. Honestly, you have to do this for about 20 to 30 minutes, okay? Great. Um, but you do add a pinch of salt and a pinch of sugar. Pinch of sugar. Sugar. Oh, sugar, sugar. So it's probably been about 15, 20 minutes. Um, they're looking good they so looking far, good. but they're not done. No. They are not done. Probably another five, 10 minutes, honestly. So you just keep going, so I guess we'll see you in five minutes. So it's five minutes later, and this is what they're supposed to be looking like. They're dark, they're nice, Look. they're golden brown. Look at that. Fire. Pretty much. That yeah. takes a while, guys. Be patient. Yeah. If you're hungry, don't cook these. Your mayonnaise. Mayonnaise. Next up, add your ketchup. Now add your ketchup. Next, add your chives. Now add the chives, guys. Ooh. Okay, and next up, Worcestershire sauce. Now it's time for the gherkins. I don't really like gherkins, like, on their own. I mean, I haven't tried them, but I, I like the, the subtle taste they give yeah. in sauces like this. Now you're going to mix all them ingredients together and then add them golden onions to the mix. So, guys, once that is all in, you just Honestly, just go to town keep, with keep it. Keep going. And it's actually looking pretty good, if I may, if I do say so myself. It looks like the in and out spread. So next step, we're gonna put some oil in the pan and crisp up these thick onions. For some garnish, you know, okay. for the top of the burger. For that crunch. When you feel like they're getting nice and crispy, flip them over. Right, okay, moving on to the next step then. We're gonna measure exactly 57 grams of beef, because it that is, yeah. is what in and out do. Wow, way off. 2.93. I doubt in and out do this. Yeah, same. Now you want to scrunch it up into a shape of a triangle. I'm taking these off now because they've kind of had their day. So our fried onions are done. They are finished. They look kind of good. So once they're rolled into these lovely ball shapes, sounds a bit weird, you're going to season them with some salt and pepper in there, right? Yes, it is. And do this right at the end, okay? The pepper's off. So now we're gonna place these balls of beef into the pan and let them cook. Once you place them balls in, you're really gonna push down with your spatula and Press make it, it as thin as you can. And obviously they're not perfect. Like they're actually, they're really not. Like yeah. they have rough edges, but like that's how they look. Yeah, in, in and out, it's really not like a perfect circle. There's like bits coming out of the sides. They're creepy actually. So once that again, Whoa. we're gonna Salt on the top. Hey, you can see that, that was close. Add some more seasoning, guys. Okay, and now we're gonna flip, okay? Wow. Because they're so thin, they're gonna be quick to cook. Looking good. We're gonna make a double-double right now. So, we're getting that American weird cheese weird -ass they use. Cheese, yeah. And we're gonna place it on top of the burger right now. Guys, I'm not having cheese on mine, because as we all know, I'm vegan. Now that the cheese is on, adding an onion on top. You're gonna dice a brioche bun, guys, so it's no, a little yeah, breadcrumbs, and you're just gonna throw it in there. We're gonna build the burger how it should be built. Bit of that in and out spread on the bottom of the bun. Ooh, lovely. And on the top of the bun, you want it on both the bottom and the top. Let tomato there, boom. Lettuce, onion one first. Ah! And then boom, there you have it guys, a finished in and out burger. Get a picture of that. Oh! Ah! We are ready. The time has come guys. I cannot tell you how hungry I am. Right, let's get a quick Instagram video. It's time guys. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
It's actually it. That's in and out. Oh my god, bro! We did it! Only thing, burgers somehow need to be thinner. Mmm. Mmm. -mm. Sorry we're not talking, but this is like literally it. Success. Obviously the buns aren't the exact same, but we just thought brioche buns would be the nicest buns we could use. That is actually way too good. Nailed it. Guys, that was a success. That's honestly one of the most successful videos we've done on this channel. Yeah, I'd say that's a nine. 9.5 out of 10. Oh, it, is, it was honestly so good. Only difference was needed to be a bit thinner and crispier, and the bread, obviously, we don't have in and out bread. That spread oh. though, oh wow. Yeah. Guys, thanks for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, like the video, subscribe to us. Yep, um, and also a shout out to this channel member for today's video. Follow mm -hmm. us on Instagram, Twitter, whatever you want. And yeah, we'll see you very soon with a brand new video. See you later. Peace. Bye.